I like the gin better. It's got a nice rich green that I've never seen before to it. And it immediately took that forest over. Fascinating. All right, and then do we have enough of the new little animals to add in? We have a twibble. So let's put down a twibble. And then we've got an Oz. So we can put down an Oz. Oh, look at it. This is going to be a perfect wildlife like preserve. It's got a little bit of brown coming through. Should be stabilized. Should calm down in just a second. Uh, we just need one more. We need a little carnivore. So let's go get a little carnivore and then we'll put down the wildlife sanctuary. Ooh, it's looking good. Look at that bright ocean. Nice. All right, why don't we see one of our own native carnivores? See if we'll pick up one of those guys. Let's see. Uh, the Caton, the Poon Poon. Oh, that giant frog. I want the frog. Where's the frog? Here, froggy, 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 froggy. <gasps> Ooh, frog population. Frog population spotted. Come here, you little ones. Gotcha. All right, wonderful. It's always good to have some of uh, our native native little critters expanding through the wide galaxy and I love our moon. Our moon is just so cool. All right, pop over here. That's kind of embarrassing that we still have a T0 green spice planet that we could populate. Oh, it's so embarrassing. All right, let's see, come down here. And our little frog, it's an omnivore and so cute. There we go. No colonies for this planet. We are actually going to put down, if I can find it. There we go. Wildlife Sanctuary. Bam. Let's see what it does. Woo! Woo! Nice! You have designated porn, uh, porn as a wildlife sanctuary. You can collect up to 30 animals and place them to inhabit this planet in safety. Nice! So there's nine right now. Look, he's got his own little nest now. So he's got his little frog nest. Very cute, very cute. Do we have anybody else that we need to add? Let's see. I think we've got all of the animals from our cargo are now present in this planet, which is so cool. Let's see. What other animals? Can I, can I not find them specifically? No, but man, this is a beautiful planet. Just look at it. Oh. Oh, with these beautiful Yep, yep, yep. This is gonna be nice. And we can Oh look, 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 look. It's our birds that we love. Oh, frolicking with the other animals. This will be wonderful. We can come here and snag animals that we want to spread throughout the galaxy. Oh, fudge knuckles, what's going on now? I'm trying to bask in our success. Alright, we're gonna have to see what's what's going on over here. Uh, they're gonna be fine. Hostile UFOs are attacking, but the turret will take care of it. These guys are fussing. Uh, you know what? Here, have it. It's just penny money to me. Have it and just calm yourself down. Oh, Diva Bettys, you can have some too. Out like two million spore bucks. That's fine. I'm busy. I'm busy, you guys. I'm terraforming. I am one with creating new life. All right, let's come down here. Very embarrassing. Look at this. We still have this lava planet sitting in our home home system. Well, we'll fix this. We'll fix this. We've got it. All right. Uh, we're going to have to do it the old-fashioned way, too. Cool down. Calm thy volcanic activity. That's right. Cool off. Take some deep breaths. You're going to be fine. Look at our little allies. Do you notice how the Chibis have the same type of ship as we do? I feel like they copied us. In a loving way. That's right. Cool off. Cool off. And now, let's get you some cloud action. I have a feeling this is going to turn into a really awesome river. Here you go. Here you go. We're almost there. Which is good, because I'm running out of energy. We're going to have to stock up on power cells, I'm finding. More transmissions? I am busy dodging volcanoes and terraforming right now, people. Alright. Definitely the tree foot. Definitely these guys. Definitely the mackerel. There. Nice. Alright. Strange ship has arrived. Again? Ugh. We might have to go take care of that again. Alright. But first... Our little camels. Gonna put some of our little camels down. And then... Let's see. 
Do I have another herbivore? Yeah, the little tubes! Our little slug cousins! And then, of course, my favorite, the Avers. I love those guys. Alright, there we go. We'll come back. Got some things I gotta take care of. Come back, fix that lava planet. It was a beautiful lava planet for, like, kind of a sightsee thing. There we go. Not bad on the yellow spice, thank you. But we, uh, you know, that's our home home world. We need to have that little home galaxy looking nice. Another one? Okay. That's all right. The Grox probes pay very well. I'm coming. Okay, watch out, little ally. Things get kind of intense. Kind of intense with these Grox. I'm put on our little little shield. Zip around. Hey, I thought I was on the tail of some. Where'd you guys go? There's some. Antimatter missiles, please. Nice. They're kind of expensive, but I don't mind. I don't mind using them on the Groks to make this a little bit easier. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! That's right, get out of here, Groks. They start to flee pretty fast. Oh, there's so many more of them! I don't recall this many Groks a second ago. Oh man, look at these really pretty little ones. Are you Groks? Hey, you're an uber turret, do your job. Oh wait, actually, I think it's a spice collector. Are they still here? Are they just screwing with these guys? You're just messing with their heads. They just show up and like traumatize them. Oh, poor little ones. Well, I think the Groks are gone again. We came in time. Okay, we're just gonna have to ignore those guys because they just have like Groks infestation. So sorry, little ones. All right, let's pop over and pick up some pink spice and purple spice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wow, I have a lot of pink spice. <laughs> we may want to sell some of this. Let's see if the purple spice planet is offering uh, some good money. Greetings, how are you? That's not what I mean by good money. I want to sell this for premium, premium spore bucks here. I mean, 76, uh, 76 spore bucks doesn't just come out of thin air, you know? Or 76 pink spice pile, I mean. Hey, Diva Betty, how are you? Still not getting the kind of trades we want. And they're getting a little more aggressive, which isn't a good thing. I really don't want to have to mess with the Deepa Betty. They're, they're friends of ours. These guys are spreading. Um, let's see if the Chibi Empire is willing to sell for a better price. Hi guys, how are you doing? Still not. Man, spore, spore prices, we may have flooded the market. That might be what's going on here. May have flooded the market with quite a bit of spore, uh, or I should say spices. That's better, that's a little bit better, that's what I like to see. Thank you very much, my friends. Alright, anyway, back to work, finally. Terraforming and putting down some colonies on this little green spice planet. We're gonna make it look nice, now that we've got our wildlife preserve. Then we might need to do some adventures, or at least a little bit of exploring, because let's do a, a stretch our legs a little bit with some exploring, and then we'll do the galactic adventures so that we can get the Stone Age technology. Just a teensy bit of exploring. All right, there we go. Everything's stabilized. Now we need to add more clouds. Bring on the rain. Is it purple? It's always interesting to watch as the color of the minerals on the surface change. Do, do, do. And then we need to cool it down a little bit because it's still a pretty hot planet. Do, 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 do. Definitely need to buy lots of energy packets. Alright, and then we're going to put down the Zonia. There you go, Zonia. Little bear fern. There you go, little bear fern. And let's see. What are these little guys? Nice. There. Nice and stable. Ready to add a little Oz. There you go, little guy. Ready to add. Let's see. Carnivore. Yeah, we'll put down this little carnivore. Then a little herbivore. Ooh, I threw that frog. Ah, dang it. Come on. No, you can survive here. 
Come on, little. Oh, no. It said the little frog couldn't survive. Is he gonna die? He, he, I think he did. Whoops, and I threw that plant. I need to stop. So I can't put down our omnivore, unfortunately, because he won't go into the herbivore slot. I wish he would. Yep, the ocean is still spreading a little bit, but that's okay. All right, that's all right. We've got this started at least, and we can put down a couple colonies. Possibly down here. This would be a good spot. Yeah, look at that. By the ocean, lots of spice. Boom! And now we can have some green spice in our own little home solar system. And this will be perfect for those who get a little bit of homesick and they don't want to travel too far from the home colony. Well, I should say the home world. All right, let's see. What to pick, what to pick. Let's see, for a home, for somewhere that's nearby, not too far. Hmm. This is kind of like, let's go with this. I like this little desert. Just feeling that. I mean, this looks deserty to me. All right, and then we're gonna get the new entertainment building. Whoops. Ah, I'm loading the whole builder new. I'm just not talented in this area. I, I run away to the Sporpedia every time. All right, and then let's see. Maxis, please. And let's see, we got elevated bubble. Hmm. This is for entertainment. Where's our mushrooms? I'm feeling the mushrooms again. There's our mushrooms. Come here, mushroom garden. Perfection. And then one more for entertainment. We're gonna go with the good old, good old like little factory, or I should say for factory, we're going to go with the good old tap dancing stage. Cause we are indeed tap dancing slugs. We cannot forget our heritage. All right, let's put that there. Cause it doesn't really matter if we get a ton of spice from this place. Just it's nice to have it moving and grooving. That's a little better. That's a little better. All right, well there. Now, whoops, let's get some free free recharged energy. That's like the only thing our home planet seems to be good for. There's that. Ooh, that's more what I'm talking about. There. Sell them that. And with our little ally in tow, let's do a little bit of space exploring because we haven't done that in a while. Let's see, let's go this way. In fact, let's stop by uh, these guys, see if they have any energy packets for us to buy. Look at you hiding on this little planet over here. Thank you for receiving me. Um, do you have any energy? Mega energy packs, please. All of them. Thank you. Gonna need those, I think. Then let's visit these friends. Do the same thing. Ooh, they have, they're sitting on us something, but I don't want to make them angry. Uh, nope, they don't have the mega energy storage. That's okay. We'll have to just be content with the ones we have. All right, let's see if we can reach. We still slightly have conquered that one. Hmm. Gonna zip past enemy space. Can we? Ah, there we go. You guys calm down. You're just babies. You can't. Ooh, look at this. Look at this. It's just such a beautiful formation. And I really want this planet. Look at the green planet. It is occupied territory though, but what we might do, since we don't want to be too hostile as it is not the final way, is we might put a monolith down, let these guys get to space stage, get another colony, and then see if we can buy this world out. That's a thought. That's a thought, because I really love that planet. Look at how beautiful it is! And it circles around these two suns. It would be a very unique location to have in our empire. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. All right, let's pop over here. Having the interstellar drive is so useful. More! Alien DD. Interesting, interesting. So there's more little guys. Yeah, there's like everywhere we go over here. There's a little civilization just waiting to bud into a spacefaring, spacefaring little race. All right, let's pop over here. We'll pop over to that thing in just a second, I think. Seems slightly dangerous, but ooh, ooh, there's something on this one. And there's some animals. I wonder if we have room for any new animals. Ah, pirates! Well, it sucks to be you guys. I literally just have to sit here and it's over like that because of our, our automatic turrets and things like that and our little ally. 
Suck to be them! Hubia, the pirate planet. The pirates that weren't. Alright, let's see what we've got going on down here. A parat, huh? Ooh, a new little herbivore. Not scanned. Unknown. Where's my little scanner? Give me a little scanner. Hello? Whoop. Over here? Do we have... Oh, there they are! Oh, and they've got... Hi, that! They've got such giant eyes! You're kind of cute. I'm gonna collect one of you. Whoopsie daisy, sorry, I just sent one. <gasps> but those are also mushroom plants! I approve. And then, let's see, let's be uh, Let's put a little goof down here. There you go, little dude. And... One of the gerbils, because we're trying to, like, empty out those guys. There you go! That's better. Now you guys, uh, now you guys have a stabilized ecosystem. I'm sure that those, those little hat guys don't think so. What is this? Because we just put down some predators, but... Wow! Look at you! This is amazing! What a beautiful planet. Absolutely beautiful. This is why I love just like exploring space. Nice. I kind of want to claim that just for the adorable planet that it is. Um. Okay. Who's attacking what? And we can't really do anything about it. Yeah, they they defended themselves. Do you have a buddy empire? You're you're out of range, you guys. You're gonna have to just chill. They just are demanding more tribute, I bet. We're gonna have to ignore them. Go back and calm the diva betties. I really don't want to have to fight with them. They're our friends. What's this planet? Hmm. Can we can we get rid of a medium plant? Oh, let's put down our trophy. There you go. It's our way of just kind of clearing out some of the uh, the cargo space that we need. <laughs> Just randomly dropping off plants and animals across the universe. That's fine. I'm sure that won't have any repercussions. Let's see, green spice. Ooh, there's something on this one. Interesting. What's over here? Hello? Oh, wow. Look at it. This way? Oh, hey, we found something. It's one of the Scrolls of Harmony. All right. Well, that's kind of a finaw thing to do. We like to try to stay in peace and harmony with everything we do. All right, let's see. Let's do some mega exploring. Hmm. Where's somewhere that looks really interesting? That one looks, oh, oh, oh. There's another empire out there. Let's see, Rosbush, nothing here. Next one. What's here? Ooh, interesting shape to you, but really nothing. See, there's so much potential just to like jump around and fix all the T-scores. I know that like not every planet is going to be a lush garden planet, but it's kind of nice to make it that way, in my opinion. All right, let's see. Anything on here? There's a lot of planets on here. Anything? Any, any treasure? No? Okay, that's fine. I, I can live with that. I'm okay. It's not like I need treasure. It's just really cool if we find it. Ooh, hey, there we go. The alpaca? <laughs> can I abduct a few of those? Is that is that something I can do? What happens if I abduct them and put them down on a planet? Wow, they live on a water world for sure. Hello, little ones. I think I actually have some crop circles. Anyone home? Here! Oh, I want I want the alpaca to worship me. What do you think? These are orange alpaca. They seem terrified. What about the blue ones? What do they think of our crop circles? Ooh, look at those cool crop circles! What do you think? Yeah, I'll give you some more. You can have two crop circles. Nope, they're just freaking out. Just mega freaking out. That's adorable. I love them! They're so cute! Maybe we'll make them uh, like our future space buddies. 
Alright, little alpacas, I'll remember you're here. You've got some cool gas planets. I'm gonna take whatever treasure's hiding on this one. 